Alright, on the day of talking about Rising of the Shield Hero episode 12, I'm going to watch the preview, and then I'm going to sit right there and tell you my thoughts about how the next episode is going to be on, and I'm just hoping y'all like this, and thumbs up, I like, and if you want me to do more, just give me likes. I appreciate it, and now we're going to watch it. Alright, yes, they're going to meet Glass, and ooh, she's going to put it down on them. Yeah, it looks like Reptalia ain't going to make it. He tries to use the Iron Maiden. And it looks like it don't do nothing. Yes, glass is very powerful. Yes. So, it's been a while since I've made... Glass is very powerful. Yes, she's going to be a very worthy opponent. See, the other uh, three heroes, she didn't like them because they seem weaker. And uh, uh, from the place that she's from, heroes are a high quality and the other three didn't seem like it the only one that came close was a um nafumi but he had to go all out and use the rage series but in the process of doing that he went out of control but reptilia brought him back and the reason of the um problem that he transformed into the dragon Remember, it was placed into a, a chest plate in his arm. That's one of the reasons why the armor changed along with the shield. And the other thing is the reason that it affected um, uh, Philo is because Philo ate most of the stone, remember? He, she ate most of the dragon stone, the essence of of the dragon that was part of his race. That's why it affected uh, Philo like it did. And it weren't just because of that. Well, that's the reason why she had that power and boost and everything. But she's the one that got the most strength from that when Nafumi had the little one. So if you think about it like that way, he got the boost. Combined it with his rage. Now that he can uh, control his rage, that's what made him be able to fight against that um, soul eater. Now, from the world that um, Glass comes from, she is like a spirit entity. And yet, um, she is very powerful. She is stronger than um, the spirit eaters because in their world, they actually tame spirit creatures. Spirit eaters. Yeah, spirit eaters. But sitting right there, um, Nafumi is not going to win this battle. And that's not all. It's not really saying that he's going to lose the battle. It's more like it's going to be a tie because they're going to run out of time. See, every wave has a certain amount of time for some reason. And I can't really remember why. Well, no, I do know why. But that's spoilers. If I tell you that, you don't need to know that because that's a little further on before we feel about that. And I don't want to sit right there and give you too much spoilers. But right now we're talking about Glass in episode 12. Episode 12 should be really good because they're going to fight, they're going to go all out, and they're going to realize it ain't enough. And then we're going to have a couple of other problems, but I ain't getting into that yet. But I will say this, it does have something to do with the other three heroes. Not Nafumi, but the other three. 
And when you realize that what I'm saying, that would be like episode 13 and 14 maybe together. But, as you see, it's going to be a lot of trouble for Nafumi. Nafumi's going to um, do his best, but it ain't going to be good enough. So, basically, these two are going to draw, regardless of uh, him giving it his all. Philo's going to jump in. And she's going to try and give it her all. Reptilia's sword's going to get broken. So you know that ain't going to help. And you already know the other three are going to be useless. They ain't going to give up anything. They ain't going to help. They might as well just sit on the side or kick their asses off of that thing. So basically like I'm telling you, it's going to be good. Still, you're going to get a lot of action in this next episode. You're going to love it, though. I love it because I'm pretty sure that this is what's going to happen. This is my prediction. And this is what episode 12 is going to be about. But, like I said, it's just what I'm saying. It don't mean it's necessarily right. But if you like it, thank you. God bless. Thank you for watching because God's blessing every one of us. Uh, if you uh, like this video, give me a thumbs up. Give me a like. And if you ring that bell, you'll get notifications on each and every time I load a video. So, I would thank you. And stay blessed, y'all.